hey guys what's up and welcome back to another episode of it's about everything so in today's episode i'm going to show you what's inside an led tv so the tv that you're seeing in front of me is a sony bravia led tv and it's hanging on the wall for over an year and it's dead so today i'm going to open this tv and show you what's inside and what are the components that makes it an led tv now I believe you already know that there is an LCD display inside that is the main thing of an LED TV but I want to show you what the circuit and the motherboard looks like and what the internal components uh, looks like inside this LED TV so about, uh, about a year ago there was a lightning storm and the next day the TV was dead so I believe it was something happened inside due to lightning and that's why it's dead so I need to open it to see the serial number of the LCD panel so that I can download the data sheet so right now I'm showing all the screws that needed to be open to get the back cover uh, to open the back cover so you can see the screws in the bottom and on the uh, side and the wall hanger everything that needs to be open and then there are some uh, push locks on the side that needs to be opened using a pry tool so I've already opened one screw and I'm going to show you how I open the other one so as I was saying that after that lightning storm uh, the next day uh, the TV was not working at all and uh, we thought that the adapter the uh, DC adapter was damaged so we replaced it and it didn't work at all so the obvious reason that the motherboard was gone so I need uh, the data sheet for the LCD panel which I'm going to use uh, in a near future so that I can install a universal LED uh, driver board which is also known as V59 LCD driver So these are the screws that uh, holds it to the wall this is uh, the wall mount and the bottom screws that I have just opened these are uh, for the tabletop stand so all the screws are directly mounted into the LCD back uh, back panel because the, the main weight of this TV is uh, the LCD display and everything else is just plastic so now all the screws are open and I've used a pry tool to open all the uh, side locks on the edge these are actually push locks so be very careful while opening the uh, push locks because I just broke few of those because I was not using a recommended pry tool so this is how it looks inside an LED TV there's not much you can see the, the main board is the LCD this is the LCD back panel and on the main the main motherboard is on the right side and it's a very small motherboard so this is the LCD display and you can see the LVDS cable and the motherboard so the LVDS stands for uh, low voltage differential signaling and this is the main uh, communication or you can say the main signal that goes into the LCD display so on the top of the display you can see there is something written it, say, uh, it says don't touch and there is also something written in Chinese maybe the same thing so we can see this is the chip MediaTek ARM processor on the motherboard so I am pretty sure that the motherboard is fried and I need to replace it with universal motherboard so to do that I need the LCD uh, model number so this is the LVDS connector so you can see on the bottom left corner the backlight connector you can see and this is the model number of the display I can use this model number to download the datasheet for the display and I can use the datasheet to install a universal 
a driver board so this was it guys uh, there is not uh, much interesting thing inside an LCD TV like the TVs before that we had the CRT TVs which had a lot of circuitry inside but nowadays it's all changed now everything is compact you can see the circuit board is so small and fixing this type of circuit board is I mean without a particular tool without those recommended tools you cannot fix them but you can easily change uh, the motherboard into a universal driver board it's very easy as I've seen on YouTube I will try it so after putting back the panel just gently push it and you will hear the click sound of the side locks the push locks and then screw everything back right where it was so this was it guys I hope you like this video and if you did like it then hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you are new and share it with your friends so thanks a lot for watching and stay tuned for more videos related to this uh, TV I'll see you later